Thanks for tuning in to your day off podcast, hosted by your boys, Corey and Tony. I think by the end of today, I might have another best friend. They're committed to making you fall in love with the hair industry, one podcast at a time. Uh, you're going to grab a lot of information. Yeah, you're going to learn a lot. Presented by Hair Industry. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. Your day off podcast will begin after a word from our sponsors. sitting with my best friend that's plural i got mr tony and miss katie here and like this is like this is an exciting podcast because every year we get to talk about presley poe and friends and this year is going to be ep- i mean not that every year is an epic but this year is definitely going to be epic yeah i think we just climb a little higher on this mountain as we go it just the, the, the view is just a little bit more spectacular every year you know what? that's a really good point because i think like whenever you're building something or doing something like you can use like our, our Presley Poe and friends event and just kind of watch how it's, how it's, how it's slowly grown, you know, like in year one, we couldn't get the attention of any brands. And now like we literally have people reaching out to us. How can we be involved? I think with each year and the things that we learn to we're honing in on the really good stuff and kind of letting go of the stuff that doesn't work so much. So we've really, gotten to a good place we've gotten to a really good place and what's really cool is like in 2019 the four of us i'll include pressing in the conversation is like how do we make an event that's beneficial to everybody you know so how does the attendees win how do the artists win how do the brands win and i think we've kind of we're doing a really good job of nailing all of that unfortunately that means hair industry wins last but you know we get to win just by just by knowing that we did it and stuff you know so that's kind of cool um but yeah it, it, it's really unique again w- with the attendees you know um as far as i'm concerned we're bringing in the best educators in the country or certainly the best educators that that that, that we have contact with um, um, which is a, which is amazing. We'll get into who we're bringing in this year, which is super exciting. Um, as far as the artist, like it, it's like no other. I mean, we don't want to give out all of our secrets about what what how the artists are involved. However, um, just know that you know uh, last year both Sam Via and Rebecca Taylor they both said, "How can I do this every year?" You know, so um, that meant the world to me because both of them have done how many shows in their careers? Oh my you god! Know, I can't, even, yeah, even the year before that, Jacob Kahn. He wanted to come back the following year. I mean, it's it speaks volumes. Yeah, yeah. it's special, I think. I think it is. I, 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 I'll I go out on a limb and say for the artist, I think it's the most special kind of like event that you could possibly be a part of. And you even know. as an attendee, because most shows, the uh, the artists, they after they're done, they're done. Yeah, exactly. You know, they're or not... they're shuffled off somewhere else. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like you, you don't really get the one-on-one you don't get the intimacy the actual conversation yeah honestly before we go any further i want to just give a like a heartfelt like thank you and shout out to to sharon and charles riser for uh for bringing us into the temple um this is uh you know this is our third year well actually fourth year i mean we used the temple the first year but our third year that we've, we've spent the entire weekend there um just like just just the gratitude I, I have for them is incredible. Um, they've been incredibly, incredibly easy to work with as far as professionally. Um, just they're thoughtful and kind and all that stuff, too. You know, I, I just I, I don't believe in divine. Inter- well, I do believe in divine intervention. And, and this is part of it. Right. Like 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 we couldn't have partnered up with, with a better person. Like like if if we don't partner up with Sharon and Charles in year one, like none of this happens. You know, it's funny because we come to them with this crazy idea and like no one in the industry is doing something like this. So how can you grasp it? And Sharon's like, yeah, I love it. <laughs> like they're just so open minded. Right. When it yeah. comes to education and they're not quick to shut anything down. And I feel like it's given us so much opportunity, which they didn't need to do that. No, they didn't. No. And, and, and you're right. And kind of like, and when we approached them in 2019, like, 
I mean, th- nobody knew nothing. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So apparently a, we didn't either. <laughs> I mean, how it's grown in the last few years has been yeah. incredible, but I can't wait to get into the details of that. Um, but uh, but yeah, just just a, a heartfelt thank you. Um, if you are in the DMV area and you are looking to get in the industry, you know, someone that's looking to get in the industry, um, I would like about 99 percent consider the temple because also the um, the the quality of education that they're that they're giving is, is incredible, too. And and and. And um, I can tell you that they go to bat for their for their students. And we hear that a lot. I mean, we've actually had to, you know, like reschedule meetings and stuff because they're going to bat for their students. And and I love anybody that's willing to do that. So once again, Sharon, Charles from the Temple, um, the Temple Academy, you know, both in uh, Annapolis and in Frederick. Thank you guys so, so, so very much. So what Saturday night is, is we open up the night with with a VIP. So, um, and by the way, if you've bought your ticket and you haven't bought your VIP, please buy your VIP. I'll let you know this now. Like the VIP is an extra hundred bucks, but you're going to get more than a hundred dollars worth of swag. Um, another thing that I want to mention, and I'll mention it from stage once we get up to Press Repo, we uh what we negotiate hard for you guys we negotiate that that this that uh the swag that's brought in that the stuff that's being brought in now to segue back to vip so with the vip we've negotiated you guys so for that hundred dollars i promise you you're going to have way way more than a hundred dollars of value just in the swag and also what you get is you get a little like fancy champagne you get some uh fancy hors d'oeuvres and you also get table time with each one of the artists. Um, so, you know, you'll, you'll be in the room with them. They'll be no clo- no further than, you know, a foot and a half from you. Um, and, and, you know, so to sit yeah. at the table with five artists and no more than eight people per table. And you're talking about networking. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You get the questions that you have. How? What? I mean, I mean, it's super intimate. It's right there in your face and you get to do it with all of them. And then after that hour of amazingness blowing your mind, yeah. you get uh, front of the room seating. Oh, yeah. I even forgot about that. Yeah, yeah. So then what we do is everyone that buys a VIP ticket, like you said, they, they get they get uh, priority front of the room seating, which is incredible, too. So you'll be right, right at the front, you know, and you don't have to go find your seat. We'll have your seat saved for you. Um, which is which is which is pretty incredible a- as well. So and all that for like 100 bucks, you know, and you're going to get. And trust me, the swag alone is worth more than more than a hundred dollars in value. So I don't know if buy those tickets is what I would say. And by and the there's way, not that many of them. So. And there's not that many. Yeah, they're very limited. Um, like Katie said, it's you know what is it five times eight? I guess right. It, it, Forty. Forty. That, so that's that. That's what you get there. Um, and then Saturday night, then from there you get front of the room, and each one of the artists are going to be performing in front of you. They're going to do a little look and learn, a little love and learn, um, as I like to say. And then at the uh, at the at the end of the night. Um, we're not going to shuffle off, but what you do is you kind of hang out with the artist and, and with all the peoples and you get your pictures and you get your, the, a lot of attention. Yeah. The, so the doors open at five and the show officially starts at six and you want to make sure you're in your seat at six and, you know, we say show, but it's, it's a show in the sense of everybody kind of coming together and wanting to get advanced education and further themselves and be up close and personal with these, you know, uh, really incredible educators. But it's so different in how we set it up. And it's only 200 people in the room. So the intimacy, which we've already kind of hit on, is really cool and unlike anything else. And you know, the, through the night, it's hard. It's a little different each year. We do give them the 45 minute segments and they're kind of teamed up together and doing their thing on stage, but there's so much more throughout that we weave, mm-hmm. you know, and each year's a little different with that setup and who we bring in as far as speakers or, you know, last year we had the privilege to have our ASL hairdressers come. I mean, we really try to hit on the inclusivity and make sure everyone feels welcome and, provide something for everyone that's in that room from all parts of the industry. I love that. That's absolutely true. Um, and Oh, a uh, big shout out is that uh, for the first time ever, we, uh, we actually sold a title sponsor. So Babyless came in strong for you guys, yes. you know, so they're, they're sponsoring the entire weekend. They're, 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 you know, headlining the, the weekend and, uh, and, they are giving away incredible swag. So this year, 
everybody that purchases a ticket, everybody that comes in, um, they uh, Babelis is giving you a set of clippers and a set of trimmers, and it's their it's their good stuff. It's their stuff that 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 retails for about two hundred fifty three hundred dollars. So um, that again, that's more expensive than the ticket <laughs> ticket yeah. is. So you know, if, if you look at it from just a value or what you're getting, I mean, you know, and again, because we go in there, we negotiate hard for what what we put in the swag bag that you're going to get way more value than that. And there's lots and lots of value. Um, actually, Katie, maybe this is a good segue. Mm -hmm. So um, on Saturday night, when you come Saturday night, again, that's April 13th. Um, on April 13th, uh, we've put together a program playbill, but I don't, we were talking about, I don't even know how to talk about it because it's it's filled with so much value and and every one of our sponsors has put in a way for you to save money so you know again for the price of the ticket you're going to get more than you, you you bargained for as far as leaving and then um on top of that you're going to there's so much value that's actually in the book yeah it started out as kind of a cool addition to the show like mimicking this magazine we love and then it turned into all of these brands, you know, contributing and supplying QR codes and special stuff that is only going to be available to people that come to Presley Pound and Friends. That's incredible. And that's, uh, that's, that's mind blowing how, how we've kind of created this like mindset to take care of the people uh, of our industry you know we've must we must have gotten better at explaining it because this is the first year that i kind of feel like all the brands are in like oh yeah we get it now we want to take care of of the attendees we want to take care of the attendees right and what they is almost every single one of them stepped up and was like here's how we can contribute to them yeah yeah it, it, it's funny because it like you said it, we are much better at explaining because year one nobody got it uh, you know, I don't even think we got it. We knew what no, we No, I don't think we did. I think we kind of had an idea. It was still like in the clouds and then year two. But now we are pretty much lasered in exactly how we want each phase to be treated, how we want each phase to represent. And it's like this. I think this is the first year that, like you said, Corey, that I think it, the brands finally get it. And, and, and if you attend as an attendee, you'll walk away and you'll get it. You know what I mean? And that's too, when we speak to sponsors who still are kind of on the fence, we invite them. We're like, just come, like, check yeah. it out, yeah. see what it's all about, see what we're about, you know, and then you get it. And, 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 and to that point, Katie, is that we've invited a lot of sponsors in. We've, we've invited a lot of like a, a sponsor, a, a, a leaders like like uh, like brand leaders um mm -hmm. that that will be in the room that aren't even really sponsoring but but they're going to come and kind of check out what we're doing um so you know you just and in this show i promise you you never know who's in the room yeah. you know you never know who's in the room you never know what artist what what other uh uh, educators or artists are going to be in the room because um, we have so many of our friends. It's like, how can I be there? You know, we're like, well, just come, you know? Mm -hmm. So um, it's cool. We even, even, uh, and if any of the artists are listening now, we even have a, a couple surprise uh, uh, drop-ins um, for the artist too, but I'm not giving it away today. Um, <laughs> hey, so when you first arrive, uh, uh, we have to thank our good friends over at Rulesel. So what Rulesel did this year is that they sponsored the bar. So, you know, every drink that you get, every hors d'oeuvre that you get, and a little bit of swag too that Rulesel threw in, all that is 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 thanks to Rulesel. So, you know, make sure to uh, to, to high five to high five Rulesel. Um, again, what's cool this year is Babelis is putting together kits. Help me explain this. Are giving away? Not giving away. They are they're they're putting together kits that each one of the artists it's the preferred tools the preferred yeah 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 preferred tools yeah. so and then you'll have an opportunity to uh to, to purchase those preferred tools so you know if you love something that presley's using if you love something that 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 olivia's using or jamie's using or iris using you know you can get their preferred tools or or, or los um because oh, well, i think they're giving away the los in the sweat no just <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe they are <laughs> And then, uh, and then, you know, we have some other cool stuff. Like, what's Booksy doing with the raffle? Oh, um, so, oh my gosh, oh, I completely forgot about this. Thank you. <laughs> I, I'm like, uh, so sorry oh to my put you on the spot. No, it's okay. <laughs> 
Um, okay, so yes, with the raffle. You don't have enough on your plate. <laughs> <laughs> right. Like, all right. Um, so they're gonna do yes, they're gonna give away three uh baskets throughout the whole weekend. So for the Saturday for the show and then for classes for Sunday. And um when you get to the show, every chair is gonna have a flyer on it that's got a QR code and you just scan that and you'll get entered into the raffle. And then what they'll do is the winners, they're actually gonna send it home. You know, you'll put your address or where or your salon address or whatever in. So they'll send it to your house. So if you're flying in or doing whatever, um you don't have to worry about, you know, carrying that stuff in with you. That's so smart. But mm -hmm. it's a huge, I, I, like, I can't give it away. It's going to be three different boxes that have all kinds of different stuff with You'll a bunch happy. of brands they work with. Oh, my gosh. It, like, yeah, it's it's a, it's more than you could imagine. And it's really awesome that they're willing to do that because Booksy is a scheduling app. Like, you know, it's just right. cool that they're using their relationships, you know, to kind of better the attendee. That's okay, we've teased a little bit about like who's coming, but uh, we need to go through the list because it's incredible. Um, uh, again, uh, Babelish is, is is our title sponsor and they've brought in a bunch of their artists and you know that they have the best like artist in the industry right now. They've been stacking up too lately. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. every 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 week we get a new like, yeah. look who's on the team now, look who's on the <laughs> team now. So I hope they do it next year too. Right? Then we'll have a whole nother like- uh, They're almost uh, like, you know, like, they're like the Globetrotters playing all the other other teams. You know what I mean? When you go to a game, I mean, they have all the talent. They got, yeah. Oh, my gosh. They've got a lot of talent. They yeah. certainly do. <laughs> so, Tony, who, uh, so once you get your drink from uh, from the rules of bar, then uh, where, where are you moseying on over to? Well, I, that's if I can pull myself uh, off of watching Los. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? So, you know, because when you walk in, he's going to be doing his thing and, uh, I don't know. I might be in the back of the line of the drink ticket because it'd be hard to step away from that. <laughs> yeah, there's no doubt. So Los Cuts is going to be there. Um, if you were, if you went last year, um, it's the, we're going to set them up where uh, where Shannon was. Um, so uh, you know, this year we're going to have some clipper work, and and Los is an incredible colorist. He's an incredible barber. It's it's kind of weird saying barber colorist, but we you get it when you see it, right? Like he's just just this incredible 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 artist when i look at his stuff like the color that he does it reminds me of like a kaleidoscope because he does like the colors and then the different designs right mm -hmm. like yeah. i could look at it forever that's it, what i'm saying i'll be at the back of the drink yeah. line exactly <laughs> Tony will be the big guy in the front of Lowe's. Just kind of <laughs> shove, him of the, shove him out of the way a little bit. Me, a little bit. And then um, and then from there, we're we're gonna open up the show and we're opening it up with with my dear friend Olivia Thompson, no longer Smalley. That's how she's in my phone, by the way. Elizabeth Thompson. Well, at least she Smalley. gave her a name when we first met her. Oh, she, OMG she, artistry. Yeah. Exactly. OMG artistry. So Olivia's gonna be teaching some blonding and she's gonna be on stage with your dear friend. Yes, Jamie Wiley doing some um editorial kind of updo and uh and they're both gonna speak to social oh great yeah 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 but they're both like experts at, mm -hmm. at at social and understand it on a different level than i do and there's well and they've been on stage together before and it is like a symphony they're so great with going back and forth that's awesome mm -hmm. i remember sitting in in uh when we first met jamie but in in sitting in olivia's class the first time and just being blown away by they're not. I mean, it, it's just like Corey and I were sitting in the classroom and, and just you could just see like the little light bulb in our brain, just, brain kind of exploded like, wow, never. It's, you know, some people, when they educate, it's very natural and it's like they're supposed to be doing that. Like they're so great with their words and how they explain. And at, like when she explains something, I get it. Right. And, I mean, mm -hmm. as an educator, I have to practice a lot. Jamie, yeah. it, like comes naturally and it's so great it, it's amazing yeah I mean, both of them are just amazing educators yeah. and then after that we're gonna um we're gonna bring up mr ira pope sage and if you haven't watched ira's i mean if you haven't watched ira's videos he understands haircutting and he's going to share with you how he understands haircutting but but it's like next level stuff and if and it's whether you know he's kind of like his whole social is filled with like these like elf like pixies and stuff which is which is absolutely amazing um but uh but you know he also said he told us he goes you know that's what i post but i do a lot 
using the same techniques and the same understanding, you know, I do like, you know, wearable stuff as well. So. It's like he's connecting it on social so you can see the extreme, like how he can pull it in and pull it together. But there's so much beauty and just like a classic Bob that he does too. It's just sometimes I think for social, it's really cool to put the the power forward. But you as know? a strictly as a hair cutter yeah. myself, I, I'm so looking forward to just grabbing all these little nuggets and tidbits of, of what he offers, because I mean, he, there's no way to grab it. I don't think at all in a weekend because there's so much there, but he's going to give it to you. And so whatever you can absorb, you'll absorb, but that's, I'm really excited about that. So Tony's going to be useless to us. At he's the show. going to go from Lowe's to Ireland. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's hilarious. Um, and then, and then we're going to finish up the evening with, with again, with Presley, you know, Presley Poe and friends uh, with Presley and, and her now dear friend, uh, Re, uh, hair by Rima, mm -hmm. um, Rima and Rima does the Cadu cut. And uh, again, hair by Rima, give this girl a follow oh yeah because she is next level when it comes to when it, when it comes to hair cutting uh curly hair and again her understanding and her finishing and her all her stuff and it's just absolutely positive that's right after ira yeah definitely i'm no good <laughs> <laughs> she just sees hair different yeah i don't get it i don't get it i don't get it either so it's going to be I love really to watch it though <laughs> same it's going to be really cool for me to kind of watch uh how um how Rima cuts hair next to how Presley cuts hair, you know, cause Presley has been doing a lot of curly cutting um, the, the last couple of years. So it's going to be really cool to kind of watch, watch it, how they, how it complements each other or, mm -hmm. or, you know, kind of, I can't wait to see them on stage together. And uh, again, um, from hair industry, the biggest thank you in the world to Presley, the biggest thank yeah. you in the world for Presley for, for, um, for working with us and, and, and being able to make, you know, like the, just the attendees, like, to do a, so much for them um and then you know what's really cool like we mentioned earlier before is like presley's an intricate part of making this a really great event for the artist too you know what's funny about her because you know we've had a million meetings with her right and we're like grabbing the ideas as she's throwing them in the air and we're you know kind of working with her i don't know if it's because we've just gotten to be such good friends too but it's like so scattered and then when she goes to talk or do a live or she's educating it's so eloquent and perfect and I'm bought in on every word and I just believe her so much and I just love it. But I'm thinking of this meeting we just had two hours ago and I'm like, where was that? Exactly. Uh, like, can you talk to me in that same yeah. <laughs> That's so true. Love I you, Presley. I love you. I think when she talks to us, she's filtering. Mm -hmm. And then when she goes live or she talks about it, it's filtered, right? Mm -hmm. Like, so I think she just, she, she uses us and I'm sure we're not the only ones in our life. I'm sure yeah. anyone that's in her life, but she uses us as the filter cool. and then she's filtered, if that makes sense. Um, and then, listen we can't talk about saturday without talking about ship and what ship is doing so um so well i'm gonna back up a little bit and say we are so honored and grateful that i think we're representing more states this year than than we have any other year so we have more people flying in from all over the country um for for this event than than we have before and we and we've we've had some good states so you know again thank you for everybody that's flying in that's making this a part of their weekend and making it a part of of their of their education journey really because that's definitely what the weekend's about um but we have to we have to uh thank ship ship is a local foundation in in frederick maryland where the event's going to be held um and it it's the it, it's student homeless initiative program and partnership partnership mm -hmm. and what we learned was that um WIC and food stamps you can't buy hygiene products so you know although you know WIC and uh, and, and food stamps um help uh, feed them um it, it, there there are no, the, you can't use it for hygiene. So we're doing a hygiene drive. So, you know, um, as, as hairdressers, whenever we go to events or shows, we get so much shampoo and I've got, I've got countertops filled with shampoos and stuff, um, which I'm going to happily donate, um, to, uh, to ship that weekend. Also, uh, hair industry, we're going to be donating some toothbrushes and toothpaste and, 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 uh, and some deodorant and, you know, just some of the necessities that, that, that these, that these kids need, um, all, everybody that's a partnership is under the age of 21. So it's truly like, um, homeless children. 
it's hard with for me to the, say that without getting choked up. I know. And what's what was the grabber for me when like reading through their website and all their information was Frederick County alone has 600 homeless children within the the program or, you know, within the schools. Wow. And that's Frederick County. I mean, we're a pretty big county in Maryland. Um, I mean, so it's just kind of scary, you know, and um, if you go to their website, www.shipfrederick.com, um, you can donate more. You can do, um, I think $20 buys a child a new pair of shoes. Um, $40 will buy him a jacket, a hundred dollars is, you know, some food and some hygiene stuff and $200 provides them with a home for, I think three months mm -hmm. with food and shelter, wow. you know? Yeah. And, and that's everything that ship is doing, right? Like the, it's, they have a couple different programs for different age groups, you know, and you know, like you said, it goes till 21 and they'll, they'll help them transition you know, into the real world with a job and getting them set up for an ap apartment. I mean, there's just so much that they're providing. It's really uh, great creating such an impact in, in Frederick County. I'm so grateful for them. That's amazing. Yeah. Yay ship. So again, uh, if you guys can bring any old shampoo, any conditioner, any, 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 anything, any kind of hygiene product from soap to whatever, please, please, please be kind enough to donate. And if all that wasn't enough, we also have our, again, our, it, it, it's an a la carte weekend, which means that that you purchase exactly what you want to get into. Hold on, hold on. Before we get into Sunday. Hold on. But after after all the artists, it, it doesn't end Saturday night. No, it does not. Mm -hmm. You know, we have a DJ. We have, uh, that's when you get around and you network. That everybody that was on stage are now on the floor with you. Uh and they're being a part of the event. So, you know, it's a great time to network, meet other like-minded people like yourself. Remember, it's not that huge. It's, it's, we kept it intimate for a reason. So we can have this kind of uh, networking event after on Saturday night. You know what? If you've ever been to any of the big hair shows, whether it's premiere ABS or whatever, and if you've ever seen like the cool party that you can't get into, this is the cool party for you to get into. This yeah. is exactly what it is. It, it'll be filled with familiar faces and it'll be f uh, filled with, you know, uh, local hairstylists as well as like we mentioned earlier, like, you know, stylists that fly in from all over the country. So that's it, man. And that's really cool. That's a really, really cool kind of event. Like you will feel fulfilled. That yeah. was hard to say. You will feel, feel, <laughs> feel fulfilled. I mean, what, we, what we say is um, make a new friend. Yeah, walk away from having it. made a new friend exactly and if you come in with a friend you know tony will put himself between you yeah. guys so you have to go separate yeah. ways so you can kind of meet new especially people. if he's trying to see some hair be done yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly right exactly don't get in the way so uh so uh so then really exciting again a la carte we have sunday morning and sunday morning all of the artists and they'll talk a little bit about it on the stage but all of the artists have classes available for for you to attend so if you want to like get a you know learn a little bit about the cadu cut if you want to learn a little bit of social media if you want to learn a little bit about uh, how to make like editorial hair work for you behind the chair or vice versa make you know something to draw behind the chair like make it more editorial um we've got all those classes for you so uh let's Let's go through it. Well, so I've, I'd like to start with Presley. Yeah. Because um, she's got something cool going on is she's going to have, um, it, for those of you that follow her, know that she created her own shear and Ivy and will be there and they're going to set up a table in her classroom. So you're actually going to be able to purchase the shears that she's using and she'll, she'll speak to it. Um, you know, but you'll have the opportunity to kind of play with it and feel it. She's also going to have um, Malibu C in her class which is another one of our sponsors. And um, you'll get some samples and be able to kind of play around with that if you're not sure about what that is. Presley, it's so funny, like lives and dies by Malibu. She loves them so much. And we had a call with them and they were like, this is great. We like to give it to people who really do use it, you know? And she's like, oh my God, I'll use it forever. I love you guys so much. It was a really cool, you know, interaction. And I, and I, but I've been using IV and Shears for the past year. And mm -hmm. I've, I, I I kid you not. Uh, I need one of my pairs sharpened now after about two thousand haircuts. You know what I mean? But it'd be the first time it's being sharpened after that many haircuts. I mean, it, it's true Japanese steel. I'm I'm sold on Ivy and Shears. 
from top to bottom. Tony's got a drawer filled with shares that he doesn't use. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know, because he's got the he's got the he got the same two all the time. Mm -hmm. So um, so Los is gonna uh, Los is doing the art of hair design and color. So he's gonna really get into you know again, well, like we talked about before about you know as a barber or not even as a barber, but but from his perspective as a barber and and how you can use color and shapes and stuff um in your haircuts, which um. I'm way excited. I'm, that I might be sneaking into that class. Well, I think we'll be in there together. <laughs> You're like, all right, Tony, you cut it like that, and I'll color it like that. <laughs> well, and he's kind of he's working it backwards. He's dissecting backwards. So he's going to show you the epic, and then he's going to work backwards with how, how he got, got there. Yeah, that's it's, amazing. It's going to be cool. Yeah. yeah, that's a that that's amazing. And then, uh, so Jamie's doing something really cool too. Is that uh, she's doing runway to reality? Um, so again, kind of like how to work that out. Tell us about her class. Yeah. So, um, you know, she's like editorial genius, and the way that she sees hair is so cool. She's really I mean, trying to and, translate. And to qualify her, she's been she's done a few Nahas. Mm -hmm. She's 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 doing the work, you know. Yeah. And, yeah, and, yeah. and her editorial stuff is incredible. So Jamie Wow editorial is her Instagram. Check her out. Side, sidebar, real quick, I have to scroll this in there. She I was talking to her, you know, she just became a babyless a babyless artist. Um maybe like a year ago, not that long ago, but she's like, they're giving me stuff to try like new tools and stuff. And I'm like, me, are you sure? She's like, you. And she's so humble. And I'm like, Jamie, you're literally like the tool queen, you know, like exactly. you use every tool. It's amazing watching her work. But anyway, she goes from, you know, the runway to reality. It's basically bringing it from, you know, the, this style, bringing it into what you can do behind the chair. So how to take kind of a, maybe a little bit more avant-garde or a more high-end look, but really translate it into what people want, whether mm. it's in galas or weddings or, you know, whatever it is. And if you are even the littlest bit wondering about updos or how to do hair like that, styling, finishing hair, this class is only $150. I don't wow. think you understand. <laughs> No, it's a three hour hands on class with Jamie Wiley for one hundred and fifty dollars. That's amazing. I, I can't. Uh, uh, yeah, exactly. That's there you it. go. Yeah. Like this, like that is one of those opportunities where you're like, if you did sort of like when Corey and I had an opportunity to uh, do a friends and family stock in Under Armour, we didn't do it. You just look back, <laughs> you're like. Man, we were stupid. <laughs> Big dummy. You know, when you had that kind of opportunity, yes. you know what I mean? And you look back, it's like, man, why didn't I do it? You know? Mm -hmm. So are you saying Jamie's crypto in 2012? That's right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Uh, and th another class that I'm excited about, and why I'm excited about is because I've taken it. And it's incredible. So Olivia... Not lo no longer Smalley Thompson, um, <laughs> OMG Artistry. She's teaching her her social media. Now, granted, I took it in 2018. I'm sure it's changed a lot since then, um, as social has. But I'm going to tell you, in 2018, when when I took the when Tony and I took the class, it is so specific. There is like no gray area. She's like. This is what your phone settings need to be. This is what your background needs to be. This is how you position the person. This is the lighting that you need. There's no gray area. It's not like, you know how like you go to some class if they're talking about camera settings, and like, I don't know, this is the setting that I use or this is the aperture that I use. There's none of that. This is what I use. This is how you get the looks. But what was crazy is that that's that's when I, when I was talking about earlier how our mind were just blown because not only did she tell you that, you pulled out your phone and you we were actually doing it in yeah. the class and you can physically see what she was talking about and it's like wow it was just the next level mind blown uh and like you said that was 2018 so yeah, you yeah. know yeah she's one of those people that doesn't keep anything like to herself right she's shares everything yeah. wants everyone to to do well you know and also only 150 dollars that's incredible <laughs> That's absolutely <laughs> incredible. Um, and then uh, next up, we have Mr. Ira Pope Sage again. He's going to go over his clock. So he's I know. <laughs> Yo, that's where you'll find me. <laughs> um, he's going over his clock cutting method, and his clock cutting method is just the way that he understands um, the way th how he explains um, how how he cuts hair. And it's and even as like a non cutter, I get it. Like I kind of think I can do it, you know, because I've watched him do it a couple times or teach it a couple times, and 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 I left with the confidence of like. Even though I don't own shears, IBM. Even though I don't own, I got shears, extra shears in my drawer. 
Thanks to Ozzy <laughs> Land. Yeah. Yeah, for another reason, thank you. That's that's oh, that's awesome. Um, but um, but you, you I, I left with confidence that I could do it. So I mean, it's not this super complex thing to where you know you're not going to understand it. You're going to understand it. And you're well, gonna it understand it's like it. one of those things where you know it looks so complicated until he explains it to you. Watch him, and he explains it so well. Like, really? Wow. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? You, like. It gives someone like Corey the confidence to be able to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Even Corey. <laughs> you know, and Ira, he's so cool. Like, listening to him talk, he's, like, just such a nice guy, has such a great heart. And, um, you know, I feel like he is just such a perfect completion of, you know, the people we invited, who we really look to invite, the people that we really want to be a part of this kind of thing. He just yeah. emulates that. Uh, completely. I mean, Ira is the sweetest, nicest, most thoughtful person, and you'll see it. And and again, he doesn't have to tell you. He just exudes this energy. You know, you're definitely going to see it uh, both Saturday night and in his class. It, you're going to be mind blown about what he has to offer. Okay, so the next class I want to talk about is Rima's Cadu Cadu class. It's not the full Cadu certification. But 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 she's gonna like go through a lot of the consultation and, and a lot of how the work done. And let me tell you, this is crazy. And this is the first time this has ever happened for Presley Poe and friends, is that we had Rima build out like 14 months before this show. Like like going into the show, going into the show, we had already going into last year's show, we had already invited Rima to do this year's show. So um in the little sidebar, uh Katie goes. Oh my God, Corey, do you follow this girl hair by Rima? And I think I reached out to her that afternoon. Yeah. You know, I, I think, think so. I reached out to her and be like, we need a little bit of that love. Um, and I also sent it to Presley. And of course, Presley's like, I've been on that wagon. You know, so, <laughs> yeah. you know Presley. She already fucking, knew. She already knew stuff. Mm-hmm. So um when 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 we were all of us, including Presley, were able to talk to Rima again, just a sweet, sweet, kind, nice person. Like I I can't I can't tell you how how egoless the evening's going to be, you know, and that's, that's with everybody. And like, that's, these are the people that, 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 that we want to attract. And these are the people that we want to put in the room um, because those are the people that truly care about you and your journey as well. And, and, and all they're doing is sharing their experience on thousand percent why, why, why they're awesome. And then did we talk about, we talk about Presley's class. So yeah. did, with uh you're going to get the Ivy, the, the, you're going to get the chance to, I think use it's Ivy a- and shares and, and they will be in the room for, for them as well. Yeah. Um, Interactive cutting, you know, if um you watch her on social, it's, you know, pretty, pretty much what she teaches, but Presley, she likes to do a cutting wheel like mm-hmm. you would a color wheel. She's broken it down to a cutting wheel. So it really is like genuinely her own education. Yeah, and like sense. she's kind of built that, you know, through her years of experience and and just, I mean, we know she's amazing in everything she touches, right? It doesn't matter if it's color, cut, whatever. Um, but again, another person who just wants to give. She's got so much that she's thinking about that she's curating just so she can give it all away. That's amazing, isn't mm-hmm. it? That's crazy. Yeah. All right, real quick, I want to go back over the playbook real quick because I kind of want to hit a couple of the sponsors that we haven't talked about. Okay. Um. Once again, Babelis is our title sponsor. Love them. They're giving out. They're giving out. Not. They're giving out more swag, but they're also giving out clippers and trimmers to everybody that buys a ticket. So everybody that buys a ticket is going to get uh, to a, the show. To the show. Yes. Not, yeah. Yeah. To the show on Saturday. They're gonna get. They're gonna get Babelis uh, clippers and trimmers. Um. We also. We, uh, Tony and I were honored enough to, uh, to interview, um, Oliver Zach, who's the owner of Mad Rabbit. Mad Rabbit is a tattoo cream and that's where they started, but they're, you know, they have, they have numbing creams, they have topicals, they have all the stuff on um, Mad Rabbit. And here's what's amazing. If you're listening in, if you're listening in and, and you're a tattoo queen, like Tony, here, here's what, <laughs> here's what they're doing is you're going to have in your, in the playbook or in the in the program you're going to have a QR code you zap that QR code one person from the Presley Poe and Friends weekend is going the mad rabbit's going to fly you from your destination to Los Angeles for the weekend and you're going to sit in the mad rabbit headquarters and have a $1000 tattoo session at the headquarters and and they have they have some of the uh, the tattoo industry is is kind of turning into 
like the hair industry where they're going to have like sponsored artists. So you'll have like, you know, the Presley Poe equivalent of tattoos, you know, doing your tattoo. They only have, I think like 10 in, in, in house, but you know, they are the best of the best of what they do. So to me, that's a, that's just so literally a free two day trip to LA free flight, free stay. And a free tattoo up to a thousand dollars worth. Thousand dollars. Can I can I scan all the QR codes and, and all the playbills first? <laughs> that, that, hey, there's only one entry, Tony. Who wins? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I can uh, Oliver, if you're listening in, can yeah. I can I go a chaperone? Yeah. Right. <laughs> can I go a chaperone? Um, this year we have uh we have Marlo Beauty. That's a that, that's that's uh that's been kind enough to uh to, to sponsor to sponsor the weekend and then so marlo's gonna have a qr code within the book and anyone who attends presley poe will also have you know special access to that code and i believe it's going to be good for up to a week after the show oh that's amazing yeah. so you get to save a couple of dollars there um uh, we, we talked about booksy and what booksy's doing they're, they're going to give away you know kind of a uh, uh, some gift baskets that, that that you sign up for um, with them. Uh, Malibu, Malibu C is giving away some of their awesome swag. I mean, uh, honestly, like their products are so amazing. And, and you know, just if you haven't used Malibu C, I'm sure you've read about it. I'm, I, I know that I, I'm always in emergency mode. And like, as soon as like I'm, I'm doing a correction or as soon as something is, I go where, what Malibu does is going to help me here, you know, cause they seem to have the product that like helps like everything right. Um, for them, uh, we talked about Ruzo before, uh, Ruzo, um, they're going to give away a little bit of swag, but they're also sponsoring the bar. So, you know, give it, give, give a toast to every time that, um, that, that you're at the, at the show, give a toast, uh, to Ruzo and those guys. Um, and, and once again, we talked about this a little bit before, but dude, I cannot tell you, um, how many thanks we have for Sharon and Charles Riser at the uh, temple. The whole weekend could not happen without them. Completely, completely. Um, it, it's really, really cool and really, really generous of them allowing us to take over their space. And boy, do we take it over. Do you, ever, do you guys ever feel guilty during the weekend? Like we've taken over so much of the space. You're like, eh, you know, no. he doesn't feel guilty, but no. you know, I, I, always feel, I always feel a little guilty about it. Um, but, uh, but yeah. I know what it's doing. Yeah. And and the access we're giving. Fair. That's fair enough. And, you know, uh, if you're if you're a uh, student at the temple, Sharon always keeps a couple of our artists for the weekend. And boy, is she keeping some killers this year. Oh, and I don't know if you guys know this. If you're in school at the temple specifically, I'm not sure about other schools. But if you're in school, if you attend the show or any of the classes, that's ours for you. Oh, yeah. 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 They'll give it. I didn't know that. that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I didn't know that either. Um, I guess Sharon can give those hours. I don't know if any other school. Well, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Put, in the temple. put on, put in for it. So once again, all the information is available at pressypoeandfriends.com. We're once again, ecstatic and excited and, and all that stuff to, to see you guys. Um, if you're listening to this and you're not going to, uh, not going to attend, I apologize for the FOMO that you're going to be feeling mm -hmm. because, um, it, it it's legitimately mm -hmm. a weekend that you should have the FOMOs. We should probably name it that, you know, Presley and, oh, and the FOMO or press, you know, <laughs> like Presley Poe and friends. FOMO or whatever, whatever that is. Anyways, once again, pressypoeandfriends.com. We can't wait to see you. Please, 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 if you're in the room and if you've listened this long, please come say hi to Tony, Katie, and I. Um, we, we'd Definitely. love to meet you. Um, and take a pic. Tell us, take a take pic. Take a exactly. selfie if with you. If you can pull Tony away from the hair. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, by that time, it's over, right? <laughs> the hair, hair's done. <laughs> <laughs> that's right uh once again thank you guys to thank you for all the attendees that have come in the years past thank you for all the artists that have come in the years past just thank you guys so much for making this an incredibly special weekend thanks for listening if you enjoyed this episode and you'd like to help support the podcast share it with friends give us a rating and drop a review to listen to all the latest podcasts please subscribe from your favorite podcast outlet and to stay connected on and off the show you can follow us at hair Distry on instagram and all other social media platforms thanks again and we'll see you next time peace and love